Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install a custom firmware, uh, more specifically Luma um, 3DS, onto your uh, Nintendo 3DS, your new Nintendo, or XL, or any of that, basically any 3DS or 2DS option you have. And it's going to be slightly strange, because instead of going through everything myself, um, like I normally might do in a video um, step by step and showing you a video of it all, um, I'm very much just going to direct you to this site here. So it's going to be a short video, and the reason for that is because this site is very specifically designed for it, 3ds.guide. Um, so much so that it, holds, it contains everything from every potential different um, 3ds you have from every different version. For example, so if I want to do, just say I do old 2ds, and it has, for all the different versions you may need it for. Um, uh, of course, there are, as you can see, there are the odd blank here, but you know, you're know you not really going to be running on this old s software. Um, and so, just say I'm on this, and it gives you a full detailed description. Um, for example, all the files you may need for absolutely everything, the links to everything, and just, uh, it's, well, very much, it's a perfect, uh, perfect way to uh, or try out custom firmware. The reason why it's perfect, if you'd follow it, it's safe. You can, you know, it's extremely hard to brick a 3DS. I can't help you how responsible for this. Um, just follow it and it, you know, you shall find uh, the right answer. How to do anything perfectly well. It is, well, it's a perfect um, guide. And so yeah, I'll link this in the description below and please do, please use it and follow it. I think if I were to show you, I would maybe get something wrong, or I wouldn't be able to be as detailed as this guide is. So yeah, well, thank you very much for watching. Please like, rate, subscribe, or share with your friends, or click the subscribe button on the screen here. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.